Hi guys, in this tutorial we will learn how if statement works. If statements help you in choosing set of events that need to be executed based on certain conditions. In programming language this is how if statement is used. We use the keyword if followed by conditions inside the brackets and the resulting action if the condition is true is listed inside the set of flower brackets. There is second variation of if statement. It is called if else statement. As you can see, there is a small addition to the if statement. If the condition is true, you execute task enclosed under if keyword. If the condition is false, then we execute the statements under else keyword. Now what in case if you wanted to check multiple conditions and pick the tasks you want to execute based on that. We can use else if statements. We will see how we can use if else statements in Energia. We would be needing MSP430 launchpad, potentiometer, few hookup wires. Connect the right pin and left pin of port to VCC and ground respectively. Connect the middle pin of port to analog pin like A3. Now let's open up Energia. We will import an existing code example by going to File, Examples, Controls, If Statement Conditional. In the code example, we can see that we have a setup and loop portion. In the setup, we configure pin 14, which is green LED in the code, as our output pin. We initialize serial communications at 9600 bits per second. Now let us see what happens in the loop portion of the code. Here, we read the pot values using analog read function. We check the condition if pot value is greater than threshold. If it is true, we execute our action, part of if loop enclosed in braces, which is to turn the LED on. If the condition is false, then we execute the else part, which is to turn off the LED. And that's it. You can check out the potentiometer values as you change on the serial monitor using serial.print function. Press the verify and download button and watch how LED turns on and off as pot values are changed with the help of if loop. 